Hey, I promise you, I never felt like this before. You're very special to me, Debbie. I don't know if I can do this, William. I can't be in a relationship with my own boss. I'm not the kind of person anymore. Hey, no one will know, okay? Besides, I will hate to see your salary drop. Especially such rough times. Uh, yeah, thanks, Debbie. Just make sure to go over those mails, okay? Certainly. What do you want, Sarah? I want to quit. Why? You think you're too good for this company? I don't want to work for my husband anymore. I think it's unhealthy. And a few more reasons that I prefer to keep to myself at the moment. Okay, fine. Whatever suits you, honey. Great. We'll discuss it at home. I'm too busy right now. <laughs> no, but seriously, I cannot be with him. Because he's a control freak, I'm telling you. He's suffocating me. And you know what? I think he's married. Yeah, and she works here too. She has to know. Unless she's choosing to look the other way around. Yeah. Okay then, I'll talk to him and update you. Bye. I know he cheats on me. I've known it for years, but how can I leave him when I have nowhere to go? Not a job, or a place to call home. Go away. We need to talk. Go we away. We need to talk. About what? Just give me two minutes to explain I don't myself. To you. Listen, you don't have to talk. Just listen to me. Can I just at least come in? Go ahead. You took everything anyway. Wow, you got a beautiful house. Well, this is the first time one of William's ladies has ever come over. It's okay. You can call me a mistress. A mistress then. Oh, come on, sit down, get over yourself. Why are you even here? Well, if you must know, I came here to apologize. I've heard some rumors that William was married, but when I asked him, he said he was not. So, I'm sorry for that. Either way, I wouldn't have been in the situation if I didn't need the job, so. It doesn't matter, I'm used to it. It's not the first time. Why don't you just leave him then? And go where? I'm his prisoner. I have no money, no family, no friends. He took everything from me. I gave everything. I supported him throughout our life together and he just, he became stronger and I just became nothing. Uh, well, I can help you with that. Excuse me. I know it sounds weird, but I would like to help you break free from that jerk. I'll take that as yes. Shall we? We've got a lot of work to do. Come on. Come on. Now. Yeah, right now. Oh my God. Come on. What are we looking for anyway? The secrets. Okay. Ugh. I need a drink. Where does he put the good stuff? I don't know, just look around. Ha ha ha! 
<laughs> you shouldn't touch that. It. It's from his private collection. I don't care. One for you. And one for me. Cheers. Cheers. So tell me, does he travel a lot? Well, he's not here most of the time, so I guess I so. can tell. A hotel bill, hotel bill, another hotel bill. What is that? It's a beach house. It's in my name. He always does that. He always tries to avoid taxes and he must have done it. He never told me. You have a beach house. <laughs> I have a beach house. I've spoken to the realtor about the beach house. Yeah? She listed it, but she says it will take a few months before someone buys it. There's not much time. We need to act fast. I still don't understand why you're helping me. He's gonna fire you after this. You know that, right? I know, and I don't care. I just don't want him running from the tax man forever. What does that mean? It doesn't matter. Oh, I might know a potential buyer, but I have to talk to him like today so we can sell the house. Oh, okay, yeah, fine. Hello? Hey, baby. Really? That's great. <laughs> okay, see you later. Love you too. I need to get the act up. Sorry. Shall we? I don't feel like answering. Hey, you don't have to, okay? He's gonna regret this. I promise you. Are you crying for him? Oh, come on. <laughs> come on. He's not worth it at all. It's really good one. William. Debbie, what are you doing here? Now, don't worry about that. Come sit. We have a toast to make. What are we toasting for? To freedom. To freedom. Okay, what the hell is going on? Well, William, I've been quite busy since you've been away. I might have sold the beach house by mistake. What? Sorry. Sarah, I swear to God! No, now, William. Calm down. You still have this beautiful house. And that's fair, isn't it? Very fair. Consider yourself fired, Debbie. And consider yourself served, William. Divorce papers? We're not getting a divorce. Oh, yes, we are. And even though I don't need anything from you, I will take you for every last cent you have if you turn this out. And with Debbie testimony to your children on my hands, I have a great case. Sign them now. Bye, William. Bye-bye.